Hi everyone and happy Halloween. Um, as you can see, I'm a ghost. I don't know how well you can see that. Let me see if I can get to the light. Oh, there we go. Now you can see like the white. I know up here I kind of look like Princess Leia and then all of a sudden you see this ghost face. Ah. Anyway, so I will admit Halloween is by far one of the... Ah, sorry, it's choking me. Ah, oh, that's a little better. Halloween is definitely by far one of the hardest holidays for me to um, circumvent because I love chocolate. And it's just everywhere. I mean, there is just junk food everywhere. Like, you should have seen Friday at school. The 27th, we had a munchy Friday day. There was donuts and cakes and cookies and popcorn and you name it. And big bowls of candy everywhere. And, of course, today being Halloween at school, we're all in costumes. I, and it was just nothing but chaos and candy, you know, everywhere. Um, and of course now, I don't know how it is in your state, wherever you happen to live, but here they have designated trick-or-treating times. So there's only two hours from six to eight on Halloween night so that everyone knows to be careful of the kids. They're all going to be out during these two hours only. So I'm out here dancing. You can kind of hear the music there in the background. And let me show you our pumpkins here because my biggest thing is, again, I mean, look at this. Can you see this? Uh, probably not. Hang on. I mean, I'm supposed to hand this out and I'm out here dancing in the cold. It's like 30 degrees out here and I've got like mega layers on and And I'm not supposed to eat this stuff when it's right here in front of me and I'm handing it out. I mean, come on. But anyway. Hey, happy Halloween. Sorry. Sorry. The owl is mine. So, you know, um, so, but I mean, I've got like tons on. I'm, you, I was dressed in all white today, but I had to put on a sweatshirt because it's just so cold out here to dance around, but it's so much fun because it's only for two hours, so I can stand it for two hours. I go inside and have a nice hot cup of cocoa. So, um, but out of all the holidays, this is the hardest because there's candy everywhere and I'm a chocoholic. But I will tell you, sorry, I'm like choking. Um, I have a little bit of a inspiration back right now and I want to talk about it. Um, I don't know how well you can see this. Let's see if I can put it onto the white here. Um, this necklace here. This is a replica of the original. And it's not a very good replica. Um, the center wasn't an actual diamond. It was, well, there was a diamond in it, but it was a diamond cut white carrot gold with a little diamond chip in the middle. And now they put like a huge diamond in it trying to replicate the original for me. Because I lost it in Florida. I don't know if I've spoken about that before, but this was given to me by a very special friend who has passed away. And he believed in me no matter what I ever wanted to do. And it was shortly after his death that I kind of spiraled into my largest I had ever been at 315 pounds. So when I lost this, it crushed me. And I think I came to the realization the other day that that's part of the reason why I think I've been on this. Eh, I don't care about my weight loss stuff again and stressing myself out over it. But I got this back tonight and suddenly it's just like, you know what? I'm okay. It's not the original, but it's him. So we're good. I've got trick-or-treaters coming, so happy Halloween from your friendly neighborhood ghost. <laughs>